Hello and welcome to WordPress Tutorials. In today's video, I'll show you how to build a beautiful and simple contact form 7 uh, page just like this with a map and address phone and email address and then a contact form 7 with a phone background. So this is built with a free Elementor and contact form 7 plugin. So uh, you don't, do not have to uh, pay for anything. Okay, first of all, uh, you must have the Elementor installed. Then come to your dashboard and click on pages, add new, give your page a title, contact form or contact us and click on publish. Then click on edit with Elementor. Okay, you have a blank template. First of all, click on settings and check which template uh, page layout do you have. We have default page layout. If you want to uh, disappear or hide the menu of your default uh, WordPress, then you can change it from default to Elementor canvas or you can use Elementor full width uh, so the menu is included but all other stylings and CSS will be disappeared. So uh, we will be using default for now and okay uh, and click on hide title so our contact us uh, title will not be uh, visible on this page click on update now uh, open uh, click on this add row and choose a layout we'll be using this layout because our background image looks something like this so we will choose this layout and first of all click on this edit section and come to style click on background choose classic and then click on add image now upload your file if you do not have it already in your gallery uh, but I already uploaded here insert media okay uh, now for the position it will be center center and repeat no repeat attachment size will be cover click on update now for the contact form 7 let's build one click on contact click on add new name it contact us page and click on save now refresh your edited page so it loads uh, that contact form now copy the short code of this contact form and scroll down to the short code and drag it to your section where you want to put your uh, contact form our image have uh, on right side bar uh, so we will um, choose this left side to add our short code paste your short code here and click on apply okay our contact form looks something like this now uh, we will need to have a title for this grab the title and click on contact us and in the style choose color as white and as you can see these are black uh, and in Elementor free we do not have any styling tab for example if you come to advanced and come to CSS custom CSS then you can see that it needs a pro version so what we will do is uh, adding an HTML um, element here and we will add this custom styling here so click here and scroll down to the section where it says HTML and grab it here now we will need the class of these titles so click on preview changes but first of all let's update the page and then click on preview changes to open the page in new tab and right click on the title click on inspect element 
and choose that p tag and you will see the style element here so click here copy the whole selector and come back to your page and choose HTML now type style and then paste that control here and then open and close the brackets now type first of all scroll up so you can see now here type color hash triple F and it's white okay now come to your page click on update now add some uh, background overlay here so we can see the titles uh, more visibly and come to the styling tab this was the background now choose background overlay and choose classic now choose color somewhat uh, darker color you can also choose black and then come to the opacity and decrease it so you can see the image and the text clearly if you increase it then the image will not be visible but if you decrease it uh, the text will not be visible so keep the balance so you can see the uh, both of them click on update okay after styling this we will add a map and also please remember that we will add two separate fields for first name and last name within this uh, common row because if you see my uh, demo version then we have first name and last name in the same row so uh, in our form we will also do that uh, with contact form 7 so first of all open your contact form editor and copy this first field and add it in the next line uh, change your name to first name as well as the name of the field now choose this one to last name change the slug as well okay uh, after this we will come to mail section you can see that there is no your uh, no first and last name so first of all we will save the form now come to mail section then you can see first name and last name but these are not used in uh, this message body so um, change your name to first name and copy this add it next to it and last name so these uh, names will be separated when you save it then uh, you will see that these highlighted uh, two fields are no longer highlighted because they are already used in our message body okay if you come to the preview version now you can see that these lines are added but uh, in separate rows now we will separate uh, sorry we will combine these two lines into one which is just like this one so come to your form click on form again now we will add some HTML tags to the first and last name so first of all let's uh, separate them in a div which will be our parent div for this row now we will add two separate divs for these two columns one this one close it and second one for the next line then close it okay for the first line we will type style and float left which will make it uh, float left if uh, the width is less than the first one list okay float left and width will be 49 percent I'll tell you why we uh, chose 49 and why not 50 percent so copy this line and add it to the second column as well now save it and let's see the impact 
on front end refresh the preview okay these two are added here and now about this 2% uh, margin because we chose 49 for this 49% for this now where this 2% uh, will go uh, it's in between here we will add um, margin left to this column or margin right for this column so we have this margin uh, transferred to here so we will add to the second one margin left because uh, it's on the right 2% that 2% uh, remaining from these 49% will be in the middle click on save and let's refresh the preview okay now you can see that it's uniform it's a line left line right but 2% margin is in between okay now that the form is ready we will add a title a map and address phone and email so for that come to your page again now we will add a new row and this will be a full width in the layout choose full width from box width because it's the map and we want to uh, add it uh, on the whole page click on add scroll down to the map section google maps and add map here type your address here so your pinpoint shows uh, where you want to show it uh, okay now the zoom uh, I'll zoom it to 14% so people can easily watch my street view as well and we can choose the height as well increase it to the level which you want so this was this is enough for me okay now click on update and let's see how it looks uh, on the preview version okay now you can see that there is a tiny border a white border around the map so come to your map and click on this pen icon and click on style uh, sorry advanced and choose minus 10 as margins and the border is gone click on update okay now uh, we will add these three columns uh, but first let's let's add this uh, get in touch title add a title first of all add a row a full width row and then add a title to that row keep it in middle and choose the size as Excel type get in touch and give margin top and bottom about 20 20 px click on update now let's add three columns above the contact form uh, but first let's uh, add some padding to the whole row I think 20 will be enough and now add a new row and choose the three column layout in the first column click here and scroll down to the general and choose icon box or first icon will be the address so choose Google or choose map and choose the icon of your choice click on insert now type in the title for this section and then we will use our address whichever address you want to add it but I'll copy the map address which is more accurate because I use the map for that paste it here and increase the size of the icon click on style and choose what size you want and then come to content again and the view default change it to framed 
so it makes a circle let's reduce the size because it's too large for that section okay this is fine now as we have our template ready copy this click on duplicate or copy and paste it here and here now this will be the email address so change it to the envelope and this will be the phone so change it to phone okay change the title for email xyz at abc.com and the phone number will be phone title and then plus one and our phone number click on update now let's see how the preview looks like our title these three sections and finally our contact form so uh, we will add some margin to this line because it looks too sketchy margin top and margin bottom let's say 30 is enough and click on update now let's see and our page is ready if you want to uh, improve it furthermore um, like changing the colors changing the sizes then uh, here is how you can do it so uh, please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and please subscribe to our channel so you won't miss our future updates thank you